Okay, boys, today I'll be doing a player analysis on new Ian Matson Fantasy FC card. So the first thing we're going to do in this is we're going to just have a look and how much we think he's going to get upgraded. So he does play for Borussia Dortmund. So let's quickly have a look at Borussia Dortmund um, and just predict sort of how much we think he's going to get upgraded based on these objectives that he's got to get. So we do think they'll get two wins in the next three. Um, as they've got, well, they've actually got a few hard games in there, but they're obviously Borussia Dortmund. So that's one upgrade for him. He'll probably make three appearances considering that he's in this promo. That usually means that they start every game. And Daniel, um, Daniel, what's his name? Ian Matson is no excuse for that. He does play. Uh, there is a fairly, there's, there's definitely a good chance that they'll score 11 goals because they do score a lot and they concede a lot. So I don't, it, I think it might be one or the other with that. So he might get 11 goals or he might get, the one clean sheet. So it's probably going to be a free upgrade. He's probably going to go up to a 90, which is already very, very insane for his price. Um, so it might be a little investment for you if you want to do that. But let's actually, ha you know, do what we're here for and have a look at this card. So he's five foot six, which is an ideal height for a fullback. Four, high, medium, three star, four star, left foot, and explosive. Very nice start. Like that. Love that. In terms of linking him, you've, you have got to find, I mean, unless you can find a Danielle Mallon card kicking around. And that's a perfect link. You've got to find someone who's from Bussier Dortmund, ideally, because there's not going to be very many Leverlands Bundesliga. There's a few, but not that many. So, pace is obviously insane. We know he is a pacey boy. Um, and, you know, that's perfect for a fullback. That's the, the, the position that ideally needs it the most. Uh, shooting's okay, actually, for a fullback there. And then passing's a little bit low, but the ones that matter, you know, short pass, long pass vision, are ideal. Dribbling is insane for a fullback. We love that. The agility and balance is insane. He's just going to move around like a you know very good card there. A1 defending. Uh, it's actually okay because he's got the standing tackle and the slide tackle. He might catch him out of position a few times with that defensive awareness, but it's not going to be that deep. He's only got 66 strength. Okay, that is a little bit low. Um, and he's got two player style pluses here, so let's have a look at these. Jockey plus, which is actually very nice. He's got, he's got the best two defending play style pluses, so that's already really nice. He's got incisive pass, ping pass, rapid and relentless. It's a very, 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 very nice card, boys. I do really like that. And if you can find a way to link him and he fits in your team, I think he is a very good card for only 77k. And remember, that it'll go up to a 90 rated and those stats will follow that. So it's a very good card, boys. I definitely think about buying him. 